Yes, we're going to the cave! Tell the story about the no, dog. No, 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 what a story. I've got a Eastern story. Come on, tell us. It's only for us. No, come on, Redondo Beach. Redondo Beach. Was that, you were in LA, so can you back us up? I was walking by at the time, eh? No, you were in doing a few weights, weren't you? I was doing weights, I've seen you. What were you by? You were walking by, weren't you? What was his face like when he was walking by? Bright red. Why was that? Ah, well, I don't, what are you doing? So what was it, your story? What you're busting for a toilet in LA? No, and I just went in one of these, obviously, uh, toilets on the beach. Right. Ah, it was just, it was horrendous, man. How? Just the pans, three pans there and like... Nay doors? Nay doors, you know, <laughs> open there and they're just, everybody staring at you. You know, uh, it's a big, it was a cure not to get there. The guys were only shy. <laughs> oh, cure not to shy. I <laughs> cure not to be seen shy. To do a number two. The I worst. couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Bottle went. Had to get back to so it. So the thong stayed on? The thong. The, aye. It the must have been irritating, I know. The speedos. <laughs> By the way, the worst thing I'd seen was one of the best shorts for that t shirt. <laughs> Look at this guy, seriously. So did you, did you, That's wear a that, new one. did you buy that after the podcast on Monday? Aye. Where's the? Please. Nice, isn't it, though? Is that the look you're going for this summer? <laughs> Aye, this thing, do you know what I mean? Why do you want to hear a shitty summer? <laughs> Why do you want to hear a terrible summer? Seriously, cool, man. No. Just shy, simple. Simple, isn't it? <laughs> simple, you know what it's it simple. That's the last it, thing I wanted to hear for you. Shy, keep no. it simple. Look at you with your chain out, sitting on it and everything. Ah, he's got the chain hanging out, look at that. Oh, no, it's tangled with the wire now. But you've got, like, it's quite a lot on show, isn't it? Chest is it, eh? The ginger pubes. You're into changing that, you were changing gold in your look. Nah. I'm not into all that. By the way, I seen your dad after the podcast Monday. What was that? Every time I see his dad, he's always got a big fucking rucksack. But there's nothing in it. It's your man's pants, he said. Big rucksack. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> right, Just serious question. Ah. <laughs> Where, where's my pal? Where's my he's pal? Got, well, he's got a shot out of the rucksack. So he's, 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 he's sitting in a room. He's, he's sitting in a room. With a rucksack. Yeah, yeah, he's doing a rucksack. <laughs> He's still the rucksack this morning. Uh, I heard a rumour he was doing in London. Why am I joking about that? <laughs> doing London, he'll not be back. That's the end of him. Uh, fingers crossed. Cross. Fingers crossed. After, after <laughs> last week's performance. Wow. Naked attraction. Uh, uh, he's on that, isn't he? Uh, he's addition, <laughs> addition, isn't he? It's, <laughs> uh, it's one of his celebrity ones. Right. He's doing there, so we don't any, have any chance. <laughs> Aye, Marker. I know, but the, the problem on that is they can, you know to talk when you're in the hang, so you'll be fucked. It's horrible, so I watched it once. <laughs> What, Naked Attacks then? Horrible, man. Put your ass on it. What a bit. Horrible stuff. No. Oh, oh, man. Bro, wait, no, but Friday. Oi, sorry. Zara menswear. Zara sport. Ah, it doesn't hold back this guy, don't you know? That's new. That's brand new. I'm I honestly, you on it. It's still a wee bit cold this morning. I honestly, you're the hottest pundit in Britain. <laughs> Do you? In what Just way? A, <laughs> such a hottie, aren't you? <laughs> I actually think he is. I think every, oh, he's got no. that that look about him that every woman wants, isn't it? Oh, no, thing is, he's done. lost the knee high boots. Aye. Lost his tooth, isn't he? Oh, they can get aye. produced again. <laughs> He'll put by for the, the colder weather. Do you need the worst thing for the. He's, he's working on Saturday, no? No, it's the leather ones. You only wear the knee high boots when it's cold weather and your nipples are absolutely That's solid, isn't it? Oh, aye. You only like to wear them. <laughs> big hairy nipples. By the way, no word to lie, Big Ken's got the hardest nipples in the world, didn't he? Oh, the hardest. What about the hard day? They're solid, aren't they? I watched it at the, uh, co- the Big Man's you know coaching last night. How, is, how do you know he's got big, hard, hairy nipples? I don't for hairy, but the hard, you can see him sticking right through the t-shirt. Aye, uh, alright. He's coaching last night? Uh, co- he was coaching last night. Is when you get turned on? I'm getting you... I'll, is that when you get turned on? Uh, when you're turned on, uh, uh-huh. I'll get you a full report Monday. Right. Don't... <laughs> full report Monday. <laughs> don't miss a bit. But no, 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 I'm being totally completely honest, so... Tune in Monday for a report on Kevin Kyle's coaching. No did you reason. or didn't you know for the public here they are shaking pre-mark or not? <laughs> <laughs> we went through the dundle beat to pre-mark. Oh, <laughs> that's the, the reaction I get. Right, right, come on, give us the Grosvenor Sport offer. <laughs> Grosvenor Sport sign up. Offer from Grosvenor Sport is bet £5 and get £25 in free bets, Derek, yes. on any sport. Derek, we always do every week. The public hate this part when I do this, but if you had to pick any sport right now of your choice, no football, what would it be, my friend? Snooker. Oh, what, Crucible, what old champion? Still do that thing with your balls in the pocket. Fine. <laughs> 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 uh, snooker, I'm uh, snooker or no? World it's, Championship. Aye. Uh, Higgins was through money, gets through yesterday. So who, who would your money be on for it if you were betting on it? Who would I want, eh? Who would you want to win it? Who would you bet on it? Eh, hey, uh, Jimmy. Cute boy. I, I watched the wee documentary. You've done the Jimmy White in LA. Like, no, 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 my era, aren't they? Uh, Redondo yeah, Beach, Jimmy uh, White. Uh, they're too, they're too well behaved nowadays, aren't they? They're all too How are you on them today? 
Ah, it's got a wee bit of radio rental. So Alex ah, Higgins, yeah, he used to drink on it, doesn't he? Aye, ah, that's too professional. Ronnie O'Sullivan, he's still gaining a wee bit, isn't he? Uh, he did uh, something to camera, didn't he? No, I think it was the old guy. Oh, is it? Aye, I think he gave a wee bit of that. I'm not, I'm not sure, I just saw the pictures, I didn't see it live or anything, but, but you need a wee bit of that. They're, these guys like that, genius, aren't they? Yeah. So they're, so they're always a wee bit happy daft. Sign up at gsport.com. Come on, John Higgins, what John Higgins, didn't we? Aye. We need to get him on. I wonder if he's still lad. eating the crab he's, salads. Oh yeah, he's looking great shape, mate. Is he still? Ah, he's looking good, mate. He's looking amazing. Honestly, genuinely, I, <coughs> since I started on goal. Have you got something? You want to clear your throat? That's I've exactly heard that. that. I know, I don't know I keep doing that. It keeps catching me. But then on to YouTube, Simon, so always please remember to subscribe. I think, I think we're on 101, I think we're on 101,000 subscribers now. That's the thing you're doing. So we're close to 200, we're getting closer to 200. Happy days. Have you subscribed yet? Oh aye, the boys have subscribed, I think. Oh, surely. What's the other thing Ross subscribes to? Anything. Anything about that. Aye. Smoke. Is that where he gets his <laughs> smoke? Smoke. Is that where Ross gets his ideas from? Babe Station, uh -huh. I don't know. Does he watch it? I think he was doing with his tongue when you were in with your tongue. Why does that not come in all the time? I don't know if he thinks I like it or not, but you better lap it. He is a bit, hey. he is a bit horny, but. Hey, cheers. You've been slain. Is that it? Is that? Have you heard about this new energy drink? Aye, the, what was it? I thought it was coffee. Tap you know. Right. Tap masses. Tap masses. <laughs> no, listen, you've been slain. Can I reveal the can, obviously, but I said, one of the taste buds, it's going down beautiful. So it's Red Bull. Can Red Bull. Bull. Aye, it's Red Bull right there, there, aye. What about this? <laughs> Ten years ago yeah. today, one league two. Oh, the day. you've done, mate. Did you? Ten years ago today. All by yourself. And now I'm sitting with you fucking losers. Hey, come on. I mean, what was, was it? It's hard this morning when I, I seen it. That's you remember it. I can't Talk remember. Talk us through that day then. How did it go? That was the day we got caught going out. So we'd won the league, but he was fucking still raging. Was he? Uh-huh. Never spoke to us. Who was the nat? Team side of big names? Was that them all Anna? Played Anna. Aye. 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 Big game Friday night. Oh, belter oh, again. He's not on the sheet, but we're going to go. Are you going yet? Nah, I fancy it. Uh, no, I'll, I've got a wee, I've got a wee do. I've got to uh, go to so. Who uh, does that? Uh, Mark organised it for me, so. I did it. Uh, so I need to Friday night, but I'll be, as I say, I'll be. Right, put your cards on the table then. Abrov, Kelly, it, Kelly. I think winner takes all, by the way. Whoever wins this game goes up. Two games to go. I think I broke for it home tomorrow Morton last day. Hey, Kelly hey, a bit of ref. You gonna let me finish or you want to know you're taking over Frank's or right on you go? Sorry, no, I want to tap into the Do you want to tap into the Do you want to tap into the Tap into the Tap into the Tap into the You are so used to I'm so used to it. Tap into the ass. We shout out to Queen of the South. Oh, fuck Queen of the South. We're talking about you. We're not shouting out. Because it's brilliant. They were dead and buried. You looked at that on Saturday and then against Cali. Nobody's giving them a chance. And they beat them 2-1. So they're still in me, I shout. I tell you what, Dunfermline, they're United. They've got Air United as well on Saturday. Right. Queen of the South. So they played some brilliant stuff. Under pressure with that threat I can do. And they're still at it. They're still kept kept it alive. So, yeah. So we Would shoot you tap Billy him. Dodge's ass? Oh, Billy Dodge. We dodge his good lads. So he is. You break your hand tapping his ass, uh, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> so would you yeah, be scalping it, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> right, Dunfermline, uh, sorry, ah, Kelly, Abroth, give us a prediction. I'm going to go. I'm going to Abroth. I love Dell. I'm going to Abroth. I'm going to Abroth. Well, manager of the season without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, Mate, Dick, Dick, see on the way up Friday, I bet you Dick does something with him. He'll do something like that will get them fucking buzzing oh, yeah. for the game. He'll stop the bus and do something. He'll take his clothes off or something. <laughs> Pink will take his clothes off. Pink will be dancing, won't he? They'll be frothing at the mouth going to that again. I think the beauty of Dick, it, but he just keeps it. There's no beauty in Dick Campbell. <laughs> the beauty of Dick, he just keeps it simple. Just tells you the way it is. I've been listening to his interviews for the last, what, six weeks. Really listening to him. He's brilliant. He's entertainment. Uh, would I love him to do it? Of course. Of course I would. But I just think, Kelly, they're going to have a massive crowd. But uh, no, what a season. They've had they boys take my hat after him and, uh, and Dick Campbell manager of the season right, right now you getting us a prediction now the game aye I'm going to go I'm going to that's what I say is I think Kelly will just have a wee bit too much on the night score but, uh, it'll be tight I think it'll be like a 2-1 or a 3-2 right. there's goals for, for both sides aye Paul I'm going to go Kelly uh, yeah. I, 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 I want what's happening in my throat today I'm sick of, that's disgusting uh, three times now well I mean I'm going to I'm working right, uh -huh. right. <laughs> I go with Kamala I said when Dale came in that he would get so, them up, so I need mm, to stick by that decision. Mm, but I, I would love our both to do it. So would I. I'll mm -hmm. be honest with you. So how many points is it? Well, is it? Is it one if point? They win, if a both win, they bring it back to one point, don't they? Isn't no, it's closer than that. You need to, aye, 
check it. We'll have a check. We'll have, have a, a check. We have a wee check and that. But it's just brilliant that we're like, we're getting into the last two games of the season and a broth and my chance of winning the title, a part time side. That is a movie in the making, isn't it? They've got oh, the next one star. What's the movie Ross is going to be in? Oh, you tell me. That's a cracker, isn't it? <laughs> That's Blaster 3, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> That's every movie, isn't it? Every movie. <laughs> right, who wanted it? You're weak. Well, no. sorry. No. No, right. So, before we get into this, there was a guy on this podcast who calls himself Pundit that said that Hibbs appointed Sean Maloney was the best appointment in Scottish football scene in 50 years. And who said that? Is he sitting I don't know if he wants to hold his hands, his little up? ginger hands up or not. Well, listen, <laughs> just... I'm not going to commit with this, but I'll say that. There was also somebody I'll never forget. <laughs> 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 Me, the producer, and Sai were down London. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> right, <laughs> wow. Anyway, what I'm going to say is last week we obviously said, Dale, that we, we said that if, is it a possibility if Hibs don't win the semi final, he'll show him on his job? I didn't right. actually believe it was a possibility at that time, but it's true. He's left. The club was ruthless in this day and age. But you look at who was in charge, who appointed him. Was it the. It's not about appointing him. The manager that was in place should never have been out of job. It's hmm. as simple as that. You know, they've gave, obviously, they've looked at Sean, you know, what, what he's done, assistant manager in Belgium. But uh, it's a different kettle of fish. You come into Scottish football. You could see the way he wanted to play. He wanted to play a certain style. Uh, for me, it wasn't aggressive enough. It wasn't maybe kind of pleasing for the Hibs fans. And, uh, and they were, he's actually talking about them getting dragged into a relegation battle. Mm -hmm. You know, it's amazing. But there's also the fact that I look at Hearts this season. Hearts nah. have been different class. And, you know, and it's like here in our city, Glasgow, Rangers sell it and you get Hibs, Hearts or whatever. It piles pressure onto you. So do you think that the fact that Hearts have done yes. so well is also added to this I, I, for Sunday, it's, right? It's a wee bit, yeah. yeah. Because you, you look across the city, you look at them, th third place, comfortable, mm -hmm. playing some really good stuff. Uh, then no, that's obviously the semi-final, they're into a final. They're in a good place, Hearts, at the minute. They're flying, getting a lot of plaudits, quite rightly so. So there was a, a, that was added pressure, hey, Sean. You listen to even us and you, other pundits that do talk about it, you know, they didn't make enough chances. They weren't, it was too slow, deliberate, uh, and it wasn't what the, probably the fans were looking for. Should they have been allowed more time? I, I think every manager should, but yeah. you don't get it. No, it's no. just the way fuck yeah. was. So, but you you look at owners and you think, wow. Yes, what? I you yesterday. No, you were saying this before. I, I, Would you be worried if you were a Hibs fan after I just reading that? He said, he said that they rushed the decision to get Sean. Well, why did they rush into Satin? Jack, Jack Ross. Ross. Jack a Ross. week before the final. Aye. What's that about? <clears throat> so that's on him. That says more about him than anybody else. Mm -hmm. So is it the one person that makes that decision? Is it a collective behind the scenes? I don't, I don't know the Hibs board or whatever who's involved I think it's in Gaz that. O'Connor and Beaks on the board, huh? <laughs> that decision. But uh, it was a crazy one for mm. Jack Ross to be ousted for his job, wasn't it? No, it you was know, and with Maloney coming in, I ah, was a young coach, and you know, there's a lot of excitement around about it, and it's no work to it. But for Sean, and, I'll speak, and, and for his perspective, you should be given time. Given time to bring your. So why players. do they know then? What are these? Right, like, so see if you're appointing somebody, is it, it's got to be a long term thing. If you're appointing a guy like Sean, yeah. So what is it? Just crumble, crumbling to fans, pre fan pressure. Or I, I don't know, say if you, unless you don't see any signs, I think. I know, but who do you see signs with straight away? No, but I know. I just came in and done exceptionally no, no. well straight away. But like, even look at the big he's ones, Klopp, Guardiola. It takes them a year. He's a field. I know he's a January, but he needs a, 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 the summer build his team the way he wants to play. At least let him get. He's not appointing for no exactly. Get, no. So when exactly was he appointed? I think it was in about December, wasn't it? Right. Was so summer. would you know? Right. Allow him then to get this summer yeah. pre season. Get some of the players. You know, tweak a few things, and then. Uh, see how he goes next season but even that it's only, you're only getting him a season and a half I just think it's mental you need, you, it needs to lead to, uh, uh, two or three years I think three or four transfer windows to get the players mm -hmm. in that you want but I mean, any manager yeah. going for that job now Derek must think Buff. well why would I take that job no, if I didn't do well in three months I'm out of job well they're saying yeah. they want an experienced manager in now you know so what so they don't know what they want really then well what, yeah, you're, you're, you're just talking about it there what experienced managers going to fancy that they're going to look at it and go what he was getting that four months no it's, it's, it's only one month it's got to at, be dingus that. you look at Aberdeen now Jim <laughs> Goodwin's <laughs> they'll, Murray, they'll no need to put the heating <laughs> on or they'll no need to order any food for the boys Jim so Goodwin's, dingus could Jim Goodwin's Jim Goodwin's, would have been perfect for it wouldn't he uh, but the, no Jim's got now like the priest uh, he's going to get into 
uh, the pre-season, he's going to be able to bring his own players in and put his stamp on that side. You know, again, you go back with Stephen Glass coming in, a young guy. But look who was in charge. He's going to probably, well, maybe win the championship with Kilmarnock. Yeah. Why on earth do you let somebody like that go? Why do you not give him the money You know, to bring in uh, the players that he probably wanted, he was looking to bring in? Because what was what was the criticism that was fired at Derek McInnes? That he said, weren't they kind of flamboyant? Did they play nice football? Well, uh, I tell you what, sometimes it's like hell mending, isn't it? Oh, hell mending. Did they spend? But did they spend any of the money they got for Boyle? I know they brought some players. Well, they the brought Mel. What is it, Melkerson? Melkerson. Right, young, but he's a young, young boy. boy he's, a, he's a prospect. You yeah. got to give guys like that. Jasper was like alone, Nis- wasn't he? Nisbet was the one as well. But then you look at Nisbet. He went missing after he was uh, denied that opportunity to go Birmingham, to the England, yeah, Birmingham. Yeah. That, but I, I think that must have had an effect on the boy. Pro- mm-hmm. Plus, there was another personal thing that we do in his life. Nisbet's a good player, you know, then he gets that injury. So, but that is luck as well with Sean. Yeah, like, I think Nisbet uh, got done after the, the that's right, he after the, the January. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So, if you lose, if, if you go and take the Hibs job, you've got Martin Boyle, and Kevin Nisbet, and within a month, two of them are ruled out for the season. That's tough mm-hmm. for anybody. Aye, uh-huh. uh-huh. but did they look at that? Exactly. That's the, the guys in the position that make all these. I just couldn't believe his remarks yesterday. Left me mm. sick, honestly, in the mouth. Did it? I, I, no, I've done it. I mean, I like it. Well, yeah, sick, he said, well, I mean, I, I'll get back to it, but he says, we rushed the <coughs> decision, but, and we won the shoot because you're a young manager, but we were sure to appoint him. He's just making up as he goes, I like this Yeah. Guy, mm-hmm. isn't he? He's yeah. just trying to always cover himself. Right. We all know it was you make, own the decision mm-hmm. to be a manager, I mean, about it, so. No. Nah. I, I bet you Sean had in his mind like players that he wanted rid of in the summer. Aye, mm-hmm. of course you yeah. have. You've got a wee plan of attack. Yeah. You know that the players that you're always going to, because you look at contracts, you see that they've got left on and you think, well, they three or four, I'll maybe try and can I get them somewhere else and then I can get the, You've identified. That's what we're doing with you and Frank's contract. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> right. you, so. Frank's in it. No, no. <laughs> but identify these. <laughs> He's telling Frank, people. has he been told yet? Yeah. Yeah. Have you watched this? Just stayed in London, Frank. That's Frank. a shame, isn't it? How Frank, 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 I'm a busy man. So yes. He's uh, <laughs> doing well enough. No, but it's, uh, listen, I don't like seeing anybody losing their job, but there's a, a few wee factors in there. We're talking about uh, Nisbet, Boyle, but then I'm thinking Hearts situation because they've been playing brilliant stuff this season in a good place. Added pressure to them and they've reacted to that. There you go. I'll get what he's just said before that about a manager, Kelly. I think they'll go for Dennett McInnes. Do you know? Why would you know if you looked at his record in the SPL? 100%. Then there's talk of Kevin Thompson. Just there's that? the other one. But, that's but the then why would... I'm, what's the difference I'm, between Kevin... I'm gutted. Tom was managed before. That's the thing that he's got over. I'm gutted when he talks... At, yeah, I thought he'd been a, a, an unbelievable fit, but what I hope doesn't happen, which I think might, because they went for a younger manager, they might not be put off with that a wee bit. Which well, he said he wants be, an experienced yeah, manager, didn't he? And I'm gutted because I think Tom would be mm-hmm. a great fit for him. Scott Brown, know. no, that's what they're talking about right away. That's Again, what, what, what's the difference between Scott Brown and Sean Mooney? Mm. Sean Moore is actually and Kevin Thompson aye. You know, uh, but Tom, Tom would be mine because he's managed mm-hmm. he's won a league I know it's only league two but, but you've still there's, there's, another, there's another factor because we're hearing I read <coughs> yesterday about because his connections with Rangers that they probably when they touch him he's a bright man okay, I know but everyone's I, got a past I, don't they Derek McInnes I, managed Rangers would you not take him I saw course. he played with Rangers see all that no, just put that to the side you get the best man in for the job 100% for the job. just let him go on so there you think he will do get it I tell you what, it's a, it's a no, it's a no brainer. You want it in safe hands. You want to take that club forward. Derek McC- uh, McInnes, absolutely. But Derek's maybe, you know, at Kelly, he's got a, well, he's on a mission. I know, but he want to go, he want to go and work for these guys. Well, of course he would. What if K- Derek McInnes got offered the Hubs job? Takes it in a minute. Big club, I think so. Massive ah, club. But if, if taken a minute. After the they treated Jack Ross, sacking him before a final and. Maloney no getting whatever. He's just an experienced manager. He, he'll, he's, he'll be confident. He, he'll you always feel like you're going to be the guy that will turn them round and yeah, that'll not happen to you, wouldn't you? Yeah. But if you look at people, you look for safe hands. He's a man without a shadow of doubt, isn't he? But we're just touching on it. Would you go there with what's happened to Maloney? I wouldn't have to Jack Ross? I don't hate that club, but fit for the guy. The way, the way he was talking about that owner yesterday was Ron talking. Jeremy. Is that his name? I think so, huh? <laughs> Jerome. Ron Gordon, isn't it? Is it Ron Gordon? Ron Gordon. Yeah. I don't think he's got a clue about fit, mate, honestly. No. Just if he speaks about it, I don't think he's got a clue, so. Mm. I don't know if you'd want to go and work there. Are you, who's your assistant going to be? If you're a manager? Who is it going to be? Did you get asked Gordon to go with Kevin Thompson? Gordon Smith. Uh, Kelly. So if he goes to him, so I think the phone call could come. Oh no, the phone call's still come. I, I so. I'll be fucking ditching you kids. I'll be sitting in the dug at Easter Road every Saturday. I think Thompson's a guy. I'll well, maybe watch his every hell. couple of windows. But <laughs> you know you can win date this, no? No. Is that you? Don't you have bad I'll never speak to you again. <laughs> nah, I think he's gone places. So Tom, what? 100%. Aye. 
I think they should go for Tom. I would give him 100 Hand, Handles the media really well, didn't he? He yeah. speaks even as a point. He needs to stop calling it footy. Footy, other than that. Does he call it footy? Other yeah. than that, get him in. <laughs> ah, what was your other points? Handles the media really well. Everything about him, you know what I mean? The way he conducts himself. Uh, one or two people that, uh, that that know him pretty well have said to me, he's a terrific guy. Mm. And a guy, a guy that probably players respond to. That's sometimes half the battle. You can be yeah. a brilliant coach, but if you get that likability factor, sometimes in... I've had it over my career. You've probably had it. See when you like a manager, there's something extra comes out of you. Yeah. you, you uh, there is. But I, usually farts. Usually farts, isn't it? <laughs> <That's the issue. laughs> just, just from my point of view, I, if I really like somebody, I'm just, you, you, get, you give them that wee extra bit. I don't know what it is. No, just but like, Tom's got that likeability factor, but he's also got yeah, that's the uh, do not fuck steel, me about it. Aye, aye, because all the good managers, yeah. you know, I've got that. So they have. What about we, Sean? We're going to go back to Belgium. You've got a joke. You've got something you want to say. <laughs> you've got something you want to say. No, 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 no. Listen, I'm not. As Andy said, Andy, we don't have to worry about it. His brain will be fried at the minute, but won't it? It'll be absolutely fried. He did. He looked a little bit fried at the end, didn't he? Ah, I, you feel for him because ah. where is he going to go? He'll get, he'll get a coaching job some somewhere. But when you get the opportunity to be the man, to be the manager, you want to take the opportunity. And that's my big enough. That's that's hurt him a wee bit. That. Well, you know him better than anyone. So what do you think he'll do? I think I'll go back to Belgium. Talking to him all day. No, you won't. That's me. <laughs> but I think I'll go back to what Belgium. What a no game at, Will that be management finish for sure? But I just don't know who, who's, how, what job he's going to get. You maybe get a club in Belgium. I think so. Based think on? Based on him being the national team's assistant manager. Oh, is that your, your job there? He's a club in Belgium. He's a few of them. Maybe, a, I don't know, but a championship club in Belgium would maybe take a wee chance on him there. Nah? Who knows? If he but, knows, goes and watches all the games in uh, the league. You, you hope it doesn't. He, but it might put him off. That's the thing. Does he maybe want that? And you know, he maybe think, oh, I just want to get into the coach and I want to be a number two, an assistant, you know, which is one of the best roles in football you can mm. get. There's no pressure. You're mixing with all the boys, as you know. That's not good. It, what's, oh. what, kind of, what kind of job? What's a good job when they pressure? That's a shite. You want ah. pressure. That's what you think. No, but on. you want to enjoy it as well. And I think as a assistant, as a coach, you can enjoy it and get in amongst. Do you know yourself? You're in amongst. You're in that dressing room. You know, the manager can't do that. When a manager walks into them, everybody's. They're all stoom, aren't they? They're just mm. like, oh, here's a gaffer. But assistant, you can have a laugh. Any game. other names for Pibs? Oh. I was thinking outside the box. What about Billy Reid at Brighton? Assistant manager, would he leave there to go and be a manager again? That's a good, that's a good shout, I know, isn't it? Billy, aye, because Billy's a good manager. Well, haven't, didn't he got a good record? Done, done uh, very well. Oh, I have thought of the box with that one. Somebody that, said that to you, surely, no? No. But did, what about Malcolm Mackay, no? I know, that's it, he's probably on. Yeah, I'm Malcolm Mackay. Malcolm Mackay, maybe. Look maybe at the job he's done at Ross County. Top oh. six. Can he argue with that? They were in a wee bit of trouble, Ross County. Would and you go and take a wee chance on Callum Davidson again of your hips? After I know he's had a great season, but... Last year's was was outstanding his season. Aye, he's got a massive game at the weekend, Calm. But I think Calm's proven that he's a good manager. Yeah. Yeah, again. Uh, it seems to me, I don't know, I don't know him obviously, but uh, it seems to me that the players react to him. And that's, that's the one thing you, you want as a manager, players that react to you. You know, they haven't had a good season, but they've come back. He's had a lot of things to, to deal with yeah, injuries. Yeah. Uh, well, and he's got a massive game, massive game at the weekend with him, isn't it? Against Dundee. So, uh, aye, he's another one. set up to play with that three at the back. Who knows? That's how exactly how he's played the last mm -hmm. two years. Aye. have been playing three oh, at the back. That's right. Could be a good fit. Mm -hmm. aye. Really but that's a fit. That, that's, my, that's my job, mate. Aye. You shouldn't maybe shut it down. I said, Mark. So, hey, anyone? Hey. I said, uh, Malcolm McKay. What, uh, what a decision. That's a good one. That's a strong boxer. physical side now, Frost County, if you look at them. Isn't they? So, and they kind of typify some big sexy boys, aren't they? It's like. <laughs> he's, he's worked down in England, hasn't he? And there's a, a physicality about them down there. Maybe that he, and I think he's brought that to Ross County. Yeah. You didn't imagine the Premier League getting a bad manager, do you? Ah, of course. Of what course. about this one? Here's another one for you outside the box. John Kennedy? Or is that too much a risk to say with Sean? He's not leaving Celtic, aren't you know? I think. Never wants to leave, does he? <laughs> <laughs> Kennedy wants to stay with every manager, doesn't he? There's for life. Surely at some point John's going to want to go and try it himself. He's best pal with Sean, though, so I don't think he would go there. Mm, when they do them like that. See, there you go, <laughs> see, there's all the things you bring in, the relationships, you know, your pals in football. <laughs> Ain't no know. pals in football. Aye, aye, aye. Why are no pals in football? <laughs> 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 we want to sell it Rangers game, lads, right, Derek? <laughs> right, so is that a son of the Hibs? 
Is that a thing? Aye, aye. Just I think you, you, you were brilliant there. Yeah. Absolutely Thanks, brilliant. Um, How would you rate yourself? I don't think I'd really done much. <laughs> <laughs> right, go on. This is where you wait till you're no. This is where you're going to come in. He's on. Right. This go first question is genius. No, do you know what it was? This first question is genius. And I, I, I on the podcast on Monday, I, I wasn't. Uh, people said you sat off at a wee bit and then they came at me a lot. But do you know what, mate? Because right. you were obviously deflated. You were no, 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 still rough. I was still, still rough as well. I can't I, remember. I can't remember any of the game. No, I can't. Don't much. Actually, mate, huh? I can remember. Well, what did I say to you before we come on camera? I had a few. Drinks, have you drinks, to calm the old name. I was the boys, the boys didn't watch it, didn't they? No, well, they couldn't watch an extra was he time. Still? Uh, one, one of them went for a walk, a walk about. <laughs> that what he calls it? A walk. <laughs> couldn't watch it. Couldn't watch. Use of that. One of them stood, uh, we sat, his uh, head in the hands, and that. So, uh, I they couldn't watch. That's how nervous they were, right. and I was like, so I did. I had a, I had you a went few to be public, glasses. didn't you? I don't normally do it. I normally just sit in the house. How was that? Was uh, good? Uh, do you know something? I might go to uh, a pub in the future because it was electric. Was it, mate? So it was the atmosphere. I was surprised. It was, and there was quite a lot of... Did you do uh, a shite in the pub? Quite a lot. The door open, it? Quite a lot of young ladies going and watch old football as well. I was quite surprised. Why? I, well, I don't know. It's just surprising how many... Uh, ladies want to watch Brilliant, the, the football now and they get all dressed up and they're right into it. So was that a part of your, the reason you enjoyed the bar? Because there was young ladies there. Do you, want, do you want to know what I did? See after the result and it was, a good, did, it was a good result for us. I stood back, right, and I watched <laughs> all the young ones. I got a buzz watching them, you know, just enjoying themselves. So it wow. was a different... Did you, what a load of rubbish, man. <laughs> I'm telling you. You stood back and seen people enjoying themselves and you got I, a buzz off it. I've obviously You're still got fucking got steaming. Out. I'm telling you, telling you, I got a wee buzz. I love that. to watch you. <laughs> so, what was your face like when you were watching them? Or was, it, was your hands in your pockets or doing your break? So, whatever that. Where was your hands when you were like, standing like that? It was great. Or were you standing like that watching them? Uh, How were you standing? Uh, nah, I'll be honest, taps off and all that. I taps off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right, so where do you hear this first question? <laughs> no, not I mean. What, no, so what I was saying, can you remember Can you remember parts of the game? No, nah, not really. Was it? I can't, Aye, but I can't on, remember it. Yeah, yeah, couldn't mate. remember the game. Honestly, you couldn't remember. No, I couldn't remember parts of it, mate, honestly. It's but tense, man. It, well, that's what it was, wasn't it? It was like. Wasn't it? Wasn't it as, as I can remember. What well, quality wise it was? Quality wasn't, wasn't it a game, was it? It was just it was stuffy, wasn't it? I, I, it was just intriguing. It was infectious. It was ever. Listen, I was, as I say, I was words. nervous. I was just sitting there and you're just. But when, say, I like, take the lead. You know, and, and it's a deflection after Bassey. I'm on, honestly thinking, oh, it's, it's no other day. Yeah. Uh, it's not going to happen. You know, and obviously we, I've been desperate because Celtic have quite rightly won the last two before that. But I thought, nah, it's not happening. And uh, even the, when they made the changes late on, Davis, I tell you what, how well did Davis? David oh, yeah. But I was thinking at the time, <clears throat> do we need Davis on the part? But when Arfield comes on, he's always got that wee threat going forward. Uh, but what was that? 12, 10 minutes. Great finish, we have done it. It was a brilliant Great finish. finish. Really good so finish. So it was. But then the Carter Vickers one comes off the bar, and I turned around and I, I chased the few of the guys down next to That's a can, that can be the turning point. Mm. A miss, isn't it? It's weird in football that when somebody, aye. to make it 2 nothing, when you, can you remember that one? Yeah, I can remember aye. Aye. the bar, aye, aye. aye. So that's a turning point. Celtic go 2 nothing up. I don't think Rangers come back. But no, it just shows you the, the way the mentality switches and gives the other team a, a bush like Rangers. So uh, it was, but it was phenomenal for the point of view that they'd been through the extra time. And Do you think that was going to have a big effect on it? Aye. Oh, I thought they were, uh, and for Bassey, uh, when he scores that goal, it, sorry, when he, he puts, puts it across and then he's all the, the barriers and all that, where does he get that energy for? You? But it's not just the, the physical side, it's the mental side. Because mm. it does take its toll. Yeah. People go like that, why do you, I mean, these are athletes. Why do they take cramp? Because it's a mental side of it. That adrenaline yeah. inside your body it takes it out of you. But the wee, but, like, talk about football, the wee things, the wee details matter, like, Taylor not getting out to Tavernier quick enough. Uh -huh, so you can play the football in the world you want, but we done it. You know Tavernier's got a great but, delivery. Get out there and stop that. Second goal, mate, as well, from a fair selling point of view. How does anybody stop the, the quick free kick? Uh-huh. 
Kamara gets the ball and I get so Riley and Just Kyogo. Get but stop the ball. I get it. Lundstrom was Lundstrom done it twice. Say like go to kick the ball, Lundstrom stands in front of somebody. Just to stop again. Mm. For all you know, it's all the that, dude, that's the wee details switched, that come into games like that when you're maybe not at your best. Well, well look at Selig's goal. How well worked that was. You know, was it Lundstrom and Jack? They get attracted to yeah, the, the ball, ball and then the ball's into Taylor. He's on the half turn, gets his shot away. So it's all the wee things. All wee things matter, innit? Mm. You know, but uh, nah, there was. I loved the. I loved the physicality. Of Rangers the were much more physical than Celtic. Aye, mm-hmm. but I think again. But I think Celtic showed that. The last game at Ibrox, Ibrox yeah, they were yeah. up for a physical battle. Yeah. So Rangers had to respond and they done Of course, that. that's what it being physical. And it's, and it's part of the game. Rangers so they struggled with that then? Uh-huh. So, uh, Sunday, I thought they did. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So they all these sorts of stuff. It's like they showed a different side to them, the game at Ibrox Celtic. So Rangers had to find a different way and, and they've done it. They've negotiated it and they, by God, they needed it. I said last time, was here last... Uh, Time on the podcast, I'd have probably had a meltdown. I mean, I probably would have because because uh, if, Cel- if Rangers don't win that, Celtic going to win the treble. Treble, yeah, I, yeah. I, I mean, I, of course that was that was going to harm. So it was that's how it was a massive game. So it was massive. Big yeah. case said so that can have a bearing on the league. What is it? I don't. But I, I didn't know that Celtic's next game to be Ross County. Aye. So it's a tough week because tough game. What, what I was saying with Ross County, they're a and big if you lose two in a row, mate, strong then physical, just in. Uh, they're a big strong physical side county. So it's that physicality there. So I just talking about that. So we go to at times have a different side. Of but I thought they showed that at Ibrox. But maybe you're right, maybe they had the ed- the edge that a wee bit Rangers in terms of that. Physicality hundred percent. They had that yeah. a wee bit. But maybe that's a reaction to that game. Well, think so, of Roof, so, your centre forward running back smashing people. I know for the Celtic side you say they're fouls, but that's why I want my players to play me. I want mm-hmm. people to hit people. Aye. I want them to be I physical. Can, <laughs> right, I know. I'm, I'm, if that's your Celtic I, I, forward, then you're buzzing off from I'm do you off, know what I mean? I'm off track with us, right? Because you watch the Man United, yeah, the Liverpool Man United game the other night, <clears> you look at Rashford. Just dollar on a boot. Doesn't run a boot. Doesn't uh, attack. He never. There was one. That's why Man United didn't the opposite of Man United. He exactly. He never got out a jog when they were playing out for the back. And then you're giving an example of Ruth. Ruth. I keep saying Ruth. Big Ruth, <laughs> Big Ruth. Ruth. Charging back 20, 30 yards to meet a challenge. So, uh, aye. They always see you defend for you're the front. You need that side. Man United are the exact reason. You've got to do the opposite, mate. Pogba doesn't tackle. Midfield player doesn't tackle. Doesn't run. Rashford's the same. I meant to ask going in the podcast completely forgot about extra time. Can you remember what, did you ever play a game in extra time? Fuck me. <laughs> did I ever play a game in extra Fuck time? Take the balls at you. I would I'd imagine so. I can't really think off the top of my head, can you? Because what I was wanting to ask, is it as demanding as it looks? It's there. It's up, it's upstairs. It's, did you play any games in extra time? I played a few. I'm did sure. Did you no bother but, research it? No. No. <laughs> no. no. I, never e- I never even ah. It's not only the sheet that come in, the box. but it's a mindset. <laughs> isn't it? It's a mindset. You just, it's like, you look at, you look at what some people can, right, I mean, I'm going off track here again. They they don't, you're not going off track, you don't you? Aye, because look at some of the things. I see some of the stuff that the boys show is that. You just want to see people in a good time, don't you? You just like standing back, don't you? I watch them at a party. Yeah. I love a party. I miss that. Yeah. God almighty. I was really missing. Right. Get back to the days when I was younger and I could party. Mm. I can't. You can still party now. No, I can't. Maybe I'm, 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 you're just like oh, standing back and watching oh, the party, no. didn't you? But it's. <laughs> What's that? I'm just going to stand back. Even you're probably the same. You're just going to stand back and watch it. <laughs> Come on, Derek, get involved. No, no, no. no. I'm just going to stand back and watch it. Tequila Rose. Really enjoying watching this. What about you, then? Steaming. By the way, not on your missus, were you? No, I wasn't anywhere near her. Me and him were at. We were at a party, mate. So, right, where are we going? Wait, 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 sorry. What do you think of your performance on Sunday overall? <laughs> Terrible. It's shocking. A bad, bad, a bad, bad performance. Oh, I've mean, still got the fear now, mate. Have you? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But you can find something for somewhere, even though you're physically tired. It's, that, it's a mental thing as I, well. I, I remember I played, do you know who? I played the extra time in the Youth Cup against Rangers. And I turned my back with somebody that shot and they scored, do you know who it was? Uh-huh. Have a guess. Carl Smith. Yeah. Can never, f- I'll never get it my head. So what was that? You just switched off mentally? No, mate, took my back. Why so? Scared of getting hit. Hey, <laughs> and did you get pulled up? Can't remember. And does that still live me now? It still haunts me, aye. Still hurts. So what, you've cut final, 
Semi final. What's the get, score? Get me the final. We, we were up three two. Uh-huh, I know that a semi final gets you in a final, but uh-huh. <laughs> no, no, I'm not saying that. I'm telling you the backstory. All <laughs> oh, right. Okay. I'm doing <laughs> backstory. Lead up to it. What I'm saying is, I've lived with that. So it. talk us through the actual. I've lived with that for the rest of my life because I never got the team to the final because it was on me. It's amazing. Ball that's in the back of your mind. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You can't let that go. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> right. So what ball comes it? So, so the ball comes out for a corner. What you're on the edge of the box? Aye, and he takes a touch and I. Do that. Come I blame on. the coach. Huh? I know you're a shite bag, I wouldn't put you on the edge of the box. I still put have done that last night. So they did. And it was a centre half on a win it. Aye. Did you see it? The Who was that again? The big, big deflection win it. Who was playing for him? Was it Xhaka? No, he turned his back. He's, aye, he's, so he did. Exactly aye. what you'd done there, mm. and the boy deflects half him, sent to the back of the net. So it is. That's the one. The manager's gaff or not. You're in a war. Are you, did you, you, you play extra time, no? I think you always won in 90. Honestly. <laughs> 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 Always won it at 90, but... Do you remember the, 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 the AC Newby final at Old Trafford? About extra time? No. No? <laughs> right, on the back. No, right. <laughs> <laughs> no oh, Rangers fixture with my mother has been moved to Saturday, giving more preparation. Aye. And time, I, right decision. Common sense. Aye. Give them a wee bit extra time uh, to prepare. Of course, we've been guilty in that in the past, that no looking after the, the teams that are uh, playing in Europe in big semi-finals or finals and so that's common sense and well played Motherwell you know for agreeing I know they had to go through the police police Scotland or whatever they had to greet it but I think Motherwell right away were like not a problem so fair play to them well there was an ex-Motherwell player who they do go to for advice and he was trying to get the game on Monday on Monday (laughs) (laughs) Wednesday Wednesday night so they went against you Paul we're not moved to Saturday. But <laughs> certainly didn't. Uh, Who was that? Big Burrows? Big Alan Burrows, isn't it? Big, big Alan's a good lad. He's a so nice big guy. I messaged him to see if I could get back in and play with him, so. but he said no. So. <laughs> is, that, is that how the fitness was? You were getting the fitness up? Did, Did you go, go for a run last night? Mm-hmm. 5k. How about 10 minutes? <laughs> <laughs> Did you go for a run? Aye. 5k. How long did it take? 18.5. So, why? How long? <laughs> Did, <they do> <laughs> Did you play Three. five the other night? Uh, called off. Who called off? Uh, Andy's bro called it after he didn't arrange a game so what have we done this week? just a few fucking sprints in it <laughs> just a few <laughs> fucking sprints in it just eight <laughs> swedgers I'm looking good at that <clears throat> what? I'm looking good at that keep it up fucking don't let right it go don't let we it go we don't stop that. the dream's not over aren't we? that's it correct have you been running about that rucksack on? <laughs> <laughs> why does he make this that's basically every, all, all every time I see your dad's got a rucksack right. Right. massive it. rucksack I carry it but there's not enough there's nothing enough I I mean, there's genuinely nothing ever in it. I don't know what he's doing that. It. It's weird, isn't it? All my mates have always said that. What is your dad getting his bag? But maybe you're right. Maybe it is. Check, he just stops, farts in it and zips it back up. <laughs> Aye. <laughs> and then when he gets home, he just puts the bag out his head and sits. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it is in my pants. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It might be, you never know. They feel like that, man. They fucking a bit weird that way, they do. Is that right? She's got his boxers in her purse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear me. Oh. It's a bad family, isn't it? It's oh, a shock. Great it's family, bad, the best. Nah, great family. Right, we're on the bar. It's got to be introduced. 100%. Right. I had a bit time. And it has to be. But the only thing I'm going to say about Farrell, sorry, that you're not. No, 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 you're not. No, you're not. I want you to talk. No, this is good what he's going to say. He texted me this last night. Wait till you hear this. It's a bit bad, it's good. I'm going to say, on VAR, it's no, it's no, people keep, you need VAR, right? Because you need to get the decisions right. But what I'm saying is, people do not need to make, just make the decision quicker. They take so long to do it. See, when we, as soon as we see a highlight, you can see it's outside, I don't know. As soon as you see it, make the decisions. You don't need to take 10, a minute, two minutes to make decisions. But they will. But they and will. that's what kills the game, especially in Scotland. Scotland. Uh, it's what's good about Scottish football. Uh, and that's uh, what's amazing. So they need to make sure they make that quick, uh, but who knows. And that's why I, when I go to games and I cover games, I love it because you know you're not going to go back to, you see a goal, you see a brilliant goal, a brilliant move, and you celebrate it. And that's what it's all about. No, you stand back and watch <laughs> everyone else celebrate it. <laughs> oh, I celebrate, by the way. Oh, I love it. Uh, <laughs> but what are we going to get now when you're watching that goal? You, do you celebrate it? Do you hold back? There's always going to be that wee bit kind of indecision in your mind today. Hope that doesn't happen, you know. But, uh, but I'll it's take going a while, I'll take a while to get going. But aye, I think no, in the long run, it's definitely the best decision. Aye, well, they've got to, aye, you've got to 
getting tore with the rest of Europe. Stop England. Bobby Madden hiding under his covers for the ah. for three days after the game. Who's your pal? Who's your mate? Oh, that's what I get. Supposedly, yes, I have. Supposedly, me. He met me Sunday night. As <laughs> <game>. <laughs> <laughs> that's all I got. Walking back to the bus, man. Ah. Your mate, fucking Bobby Madden. What did you? Were you talking to you? That's something. <laughs> I don't know what I say, what I say. Well, it doesn't matter, it looks good. So, so Val's <laughs> coming in, so it's, it's the right decision, but it's just, it might take a wee element uh, away from the you game. You actually don't even need that, mate. You actually don't. All you need is somebody to watch a tail at the side of the pitch and then tell the referee. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> no, but they fuck about the lines and all that. Could you be one of the guys <laughs> sitting back uh, making that, those decisions? I think, Could you say, if you've got a football brain, put, you know, don't you? Put yourself forward for that. That's what I'm saying. I don't know if these people, sometimes they, they, they watch far and they still don't make the decisions. Like, Stephen Craig or something would be a good at that, He'd be brilliant at that. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That sort of type. But Craig, should be a referee. I think it's good to uh-huh. be, uh-huh. isn't he? Uh-huh. I think it's good to be guys that have played the game or not. Gordon Smith. God, aye. He'd be the head, yeah. Gordon Smith is. Boydie, Gordon Smith, and Craig. Boydie. Aye. That'd be a great three, wouldn't it? Uh-huh. What a night out that would be. You're I'm just standing back watching them, do I think, and Marker. Marker should <laughs> no, be No, I know Marker. No, I Marker wouldn't be bothered. He wouldn't even be watching the game, wouldn't he? No? He would just sit and have a... Do you think he's watching any football this week, Marker? <laughs> he's amazing, got that TV. Like well, he's done it. Do you know, think he watched boys. Chelsea Arsenal last night? No chance. No chance. <laughs> he enjoys himself. And just quite rightly so, uh, that, uh, his age anyway. When did you so. become pals with Marker? We just, I used to see Marker out and about at times, but I didn't, that's what I've said to you before, they went to the champagne bars and that, I kept away, if I went to the old man's pubs and all that, prefer that, go and sit and have a pint of Guinness or whatever, I didn't like sometimes in the, 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 the clubs and that, no, I'm not, I like going to the old man's pub, watching the football, that's having a wee better, isn't it? Aye. Much you got a bit of laugh. Saturday night, 12, ah, 12 at night, sitting watching football in a pub. No, no, like that, but you know what I mean? They're characters. Sometimes it's all off one day. It's off for for coat and knickers and all that. Oh, right. Yeah, you're up, Brigade. That's, that's, that's not my cup of tea. Never has been. No. Never will be. So would no, you know what? I'm rang with him. No, that's, that's up to you. That's so who else would be in Marcus crew like McCoy's tonight? Oh, I'm McCoy's to do it. Aye. They'd be your Charlie Nick and all that. Uh-huh. So we used and to. And you and me, Janet, just, just sitting. We used to dock and dive. Different me places, aye. I'd be weird. No, he'd be in the, he'd be in the big uh, champagne bars. I could see that. No, like no. fur coat on and all. I'm actually a bit disappointed with you being with me. Don't like it at all, actually. <laughs> I don't react like that. No way. But only. But I need the one. I couldn't do it anyway. I'm the son of a roof sheeter, so a roof sheeter, a roof sheeter. Aye. Okay, I just want to know what roof sheeter. Roof sheeter. What are you doing this weekend, then? What am I doing this week? I Mate, don't know. How, why are you drinking so much? <laughs> I do. I'm drinking a lot as well. In a minute. I have a drink problem. Ah, well, here we go. <laughs> go ahead. Right, fill both oh, the glasses right. up, see who could down it first. Fill his up. Oh, fuck Come on, Del. Come on, Del. Do him, Del. Do him, Del. Do him, Del. I love you to pause on <laughs> <laughs> Try and get it out of your chin. <laughs> right up to the top. Oh, I'm shaking, man. Keep going with yours. Right, come on, used to. Wait, right. let him take t- a wee sip, Del, because you've got me a... All right, we wee sip, right. I'm on unreal. Right, wait, on my, I'll go 3-2-1. That's the best I've looked in a long time, innit? Ready? Can you go out to the gaze a full length shot? I think that's the best yeah, I've looked in a long time. I think it's actually quite good. Yeah, no bad. Right, ready? 3, 2, 1, go! Go! Oh my God, Del, drink, man. Brilliant, oh, by the way. Oh, what a that's what you want that. Well done. Well, uh, no, champ again. Champ. Champion drinker, by the way. Well done. <laughs> want to, want, want to, um, you need to talk. I'm not completely not a bizarre human being. <laughs> 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 you need, Wait, that could that, be the weirdest thing I've ever heard a manager say. So, say, he say he's turned all his radiators off in the house. Oh, right, aye. I, and he's gone on a diet. What's the, so, what's the deal here? So that when he comes to the game, he's hungry and he's hungry. He's cold, cold and hungry. Cold and hungry. Mate, what's going on? Seriously. Well, it's completely baffling that. Marker knows him better than anybody else. He should be the man that would. He was, he's the man that knows. sitting in the house freezing, but. Just me! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Walk the windies. Eating an ice pole. It's not even that cold at the minute anyway. I don't know. Walk the windies. It's but you're not You used to put all the radiators on sitting sit in a bath for a curry and a cup of tea, don't you? Love it all the time. Uh-huh. No, but what is it, size? It's quite bizarre. What, what is he trying to just do? Is he trying to say something that'll get the boys. It must be. I get, give, them a, I, give them a laugh. There's going to be pressure. Give, give them a laugh. Like Chill them out. Make them relax. Because sometimes you, you can go the other way. You know, if you're at the players all the time, they become tense. Or uh, don't go and express yourself. But if you're a wee bit chilled out and they're having a laugh with it, maybe they'll just relax. 
He knows that group of players now. He's been with them for what? Six weeks. Six but if, weeks. I'm a, if I'm a player and I'm sitting listening to my manager, manager saying himself. that, I'm completely baffled. It's not, get, it's not getting me up for it at all. Right. But uh, it must be fucking freezing in that house. It must be, <laughs> nipples must be rock solid. And what is he doing? Is he starving? He's saying, I know. It must Thanks, be sir. somebody's yeah. naked checking him. So, what big thing is isn't eating for till Saturday? Doesn't eat all week. Shoot, and do you believe that? <laughs> There's no, I maybe believe he's eating, but there's no way the big man's not eating. No, he's not eating. 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 Was he on it? No, never that. But the only time was obviously when he had a bath. He always took me top the bath up. Was yeah. it a cold bath or a hot? <laughs> <laughs> Is that why you had to jump in at him? <laughs> at the end of that, he told me he got two fit, two fit him. <laughs> <laughs> two fit his nipples, he said. <laughs> what was two fit his nipples. <laughs> then Leachy came in and dragged my apples. We used to wrestle in the butter. Who? Me and Dingus. <laughs> Have to get the butter. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> is that that big bath? Remember oh the big bath? Life's good, isn't it? Life is good, mate. Are you alright? Do you know what? I couldn't stop drinking Sunday, Bucky. See, I've been out with you a few times, you're not a big drinker. No, it was Sunday. I tried on Sunday. I just I, go I, I, for, I, I, for years, I tried to, whenever I drank, I just uh, done things I hated, so oh. I just had to stop it all, do you know what I mean? But when he was steaming, just, he kept coming up to go, I just want to have a, a little bath with Dinga. In moderation. Can I get out my head? Everything in moderation. Aye, aye. You've got to enjoy yourself at times. Aye, of course you do, Paul. That's what life's about. Aye, exactly. Boys, so. pleasure as it's always. It's been always a pleasure. But hey, we're on the coupon deal. Oh, fuck's all that. I've finished something ready to no, go. You're not going anywhere. Right. right I'm is... going to... So you ask Derek, please. Right. Ready, this Del is... Boy? Yes, let's go. Del Boy. Right. What, we're we going for? Four fixtures? Aye. The full shebang. So let me check that. Our bro, Kelly, see how many points in it. I'm sure it's only one point. Did they not bring it? It's one point. One point. Is it one point at the moment? <laughs> yes. Right. So if Arbroath won it, they've won the league. Whoever wins this game wins, wins the league Friday night. Massive. Humdinger. Ah, it's magic. Oh, we should have put that in the coupon, shouldn't we? Right, ready to go. That's Why don't we just do it then? Uh, nah. Right, right ready. Go. I'm going to give you, I think this is a game of the day. Big freezing starving dingus against... <laughs> he'll be so jealous because Callum Davidson will be that big baggy suit and he'll be fucking right. roasting. Right so, then. dingus versus... Cold dingus <clears> versus... <throat> Hot Callum. And all oh, eyes will be on that game, so a shadow of doubt. And I'm <laughs> going to sit in the fence and say it's going to be a draw. I think, like, I think that could be a one each or a two each, aye. So do you think it's all something to eat after the game? Do you think it's all something to eat? Hopefully, some, <laughs> <laughs> hopefully get something to eat. But uh, we, to <laughs> we touched on it Might earlier. Be, yeah. Callum Davidson's, uh, you know, they've had a rough time, but you could see signs of the last five, six weeks that they were coming back. And he's got some players fit. Uh, listen, there's a lot of emphasis on Dundee. We're talking about it, but they'll be up for this big time, by the way. So it'll be, it'll be tense. I'll know, I, I'll know about probably the greatest game, but I think, I think there'll be a, a goal, uh, goals, but I think it'll be a draw. Honestly. But in all seriousness, Dingus, get, get the heating on, get somebody eating you, mate. Uh, get want get the heating stop on. Don't worry. Stop doing that. Stop don't doing don't that. So a draw. Yourself. I draw for me. Aye. Stop embarrassing yourself. How, co how cold Jink will be? I couldn't give a monkey's. <laughs> Jink will be freezing to him. Aye. starving. I no, love to look in his no, face, mate. See what no. he's doing. Where's he stay? Do you know what he's like? He's sitting in a blanket. You know? Stays in an igloo, didn't he? In a bottle of igloo. Oh, big dingus, man. Uh, right, I'm going to get... Uh, Oof, I think this will be a, a cracker. <laughs> oh. Mother will be Rangers. Aye, and uh, Wolf. fair play to Mother will bring that game forward. Some didn't want it. Mother will <laughs> done well to get top six, but Rangers are a good place at the minute. Uh, and tiredness, we're talking about that. So they'll be well Not tired. How can the professional football players? Well Who's recovered. tired? Oh. Well recovered. As big Jock Wallace used to do. Getting was, paid uh, to keep fit. If he, saw, oh, if he looked man. at us and thought we were tired, he would just say, if we played on the Saturday, he would just say, just come back in like, next Friday, I'll see you. He used to do things like that. They'll be recovered. Rangers will win that 2-0, I think. Got sports scientists and all that now. How can you be tired? It's your job. 
Aye. Liverpool, Salah plays 60 games a season, mate. Aye. And doesn't Aye. sprint. Aye. Aye. You don't need to tell me. You don't need to. Oh, I know that. That's tired know stuff, that. man. Aye. Don't really. It's a fucking bad atmosphere. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Never. No, I get, no. It's no good to work no, in. No, I get it. But that's similar to you as well with that. Because yeah. it doesn't matter nothing, mate. So, so, do you know how to manage that? And give them days off recovery. These guys are getting, mate, thousands a week to run about for like minutes. Oh, mate. While people are up five in the morning, grafting an arse, you know what I mean? Aye. That's it. So I just Rangers. don't understand I mean, you're running a bit for like the match it's just going mate I know 100% Rangers right. for me we need to ask you then Ross County on the flip I'm going to flip it and then Ross County if you sell it it will be a difficult game for Celtic they've got uh, uh, they're a physical side County pace and power but uh, they'll be hurting Celtic obviously but I just think they've got too much football wise for Ross County to handle so I think Celtic will win that by a couple of goals as well and uh, we'll go with your boys game Aberdeen versus Livingston. I think that'll be a draw right away. Let's get draw written all over. <laughs> 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 this guy get dingy. He went with that tall back. Been freezing. Uh, eh? uh, sorry, sorry, dude. No, Ab- Aberdeen. They've still got a wee bit of work to do. That's that's so. But to get safe, like. Mm-hmm. Aye, definitely. I but the good so. thing for them is that if they get anything for this, Dundee and St Johnston are playing each other, isn't it? Aye. So if you get a win, you're course. basically Livingston. Yeah. I'll be. I'll be seething. Oh, David Martindale, you know, they never cemented that top six. Uh, so I think there's no lot between them. I think that'll be a draw. draw and you want to ask Paul Slane for? Yes. I'll, right, four, right. So we'll start, start off. Your old team, 12 o'clock, Fir Park, Saturday afternoon, Motherwell versus Rangers. Slaney, what do you think? 2 0 Rangers. 2 0 Rangers. Wow, that easy. I think so. Aye, 2 0 Rangers. Aye. I don't think it'll be easy. I think it's. I don't think it'll be easy. Don't it? <laughs> <laughs> right. <clears throat> okay. Well, we'll go to the uh, Marcus old side St. Mirren. St. Mirren versus Hibs. Even with the Sean Malone. I'm going to go St. Mirren. Right. Just with the new manager. Hibs that are both six. Who's in charge again? David Gray. David Gray's right. He's he done all right the last time he was in charge, yeah. didn't he? And uh, I, but that, I don't know where they'll be as a club in there. Um, so I'll go St Mirren. Right. And I'm going to go uh, Dundee United versus Hearts. It's a strange one, that one, isn't it? The Hearts, how are they going to be? I can't games in the home game, innit? I think so. Nah, Hearts are but still and Dundee United are. Play the kids. Um, oh, that's a hard one, innit? Draw. Draw. Right. What are you going for? Draw. Right. And last but not least. What do you think Charlie will say about Dingus Knighton? By Charlie. He should go and feed him. Your team. Somebody at Dundee should seriously go and feed Dingus, man. I'm worried about him. Well, you're fair, that neck of the buds. But you you'll catch him pub? if he's no lost, but you'll know he's lying. Make sure. Just Why take you? him a wee drive. Mate, you something. should have weighed him straight. Yeah. You should have just weighed him after that interview <laughs> and weighed, weighed, weighed him on Saturday. Go on the scales. Imagine then. he's heavier. <laughs> you're a liar. <laughs> you're fucking roasting. <laughs> right, the last but not least. <clears throat> Your team, Ross County against your team, Celtic. Oh, this will be good. This will be good. <laughs> what do you think? I think Celtic will come back. I think they'll be trying to roar. I think they will be rolling. I think they'll be. They'll, they'll, I, Andrew, honestly, Bill, uh, he came out and he was obviously was quite. Then he really came out to see exa- everything that we wanted here. But I think he'll ke- they'll come out on Sunday and go for it. I think he'll be raging Andrew after that, and I think that'll be three bands Celtic. Okay, Bernard. And happy days. <laughs>